Yeah, all right. All right, thank you. Well, the manager said uh, James is out for the day, and I left a message for him to call when he came in. Thank you, J.R. It's very kind. Uh, hey, 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 Christopher, slow down, pal. Where's the fire, anyway? Well, I knew the limo outside meant we had company, but I had no idea. Vanessa, what a pleasant surprise. Hello, Bobby. It's nice to see you again. Is this your little boy? Well, I'm afraid he's not so little anymore. Son, this is the lady I told you we met in Vienna. Vanessa Beaumont, my son, Christopher Ewing. Hi. Hi. It's nice to meet you, Christopher. Nice to meet you, too. Dad, can I go call Ivy, please? And use the phone upstairs. Um, sure. Sure, go ahead. What a nice boy. I had a little talk with him about the birds and the bees. I think it went over a little too well. Your son didn't tell us that you were coming. No, he didn't know I was coming. I didn't know until a few days ago. He must have had you worried sick. James has always been full of surprises. Oh, Bobby, he's a man after my own heart. Uh, remember I told you about that dinner we had and McKay stopped by the table? Many times. Let's don't spend all day talking about James. I've come all this way. Don't I get a tour of the ranch? Well, since James is not in, why don't you spend the day with us? We'd love to show you around. I'd enjoy that, if it's not too much trouble. No, of course not. It'll be our pleasure. 